Jeffrey Powers here at Geekazine. We're here at Dell. We're going to find out how they're using Thunderbolt 3 in their XGS model laptops. We're here with Randall Heaton uh, at Dell. How you doing? I'm doing great. Thanks a lot. Now, you guys debuted. What did you, what did you debut here at CES? Uh, quite a number of things. I'm specifically the product manager for our XPS line of notebooks. The most exciting thing we've done here is we've taken our XPS 13 product and we've turned it into convertible. So we've made the product a little bit thinner, a little bit more uh, mobile, and uh, we basically just added the 360 capability to it and thinned it out a little bit. And we've also, as a result, changed our ports on the product a little bit as well. Yeah, definitely. Adding the Thunderbolt 3 USB, but you also have a regular USB-C. Tell us about the, th the thoughts that went into that. So part of it, we want to balance the design out. Because of the location of the ports, um, we uh, only put one of the Thunderbolt 3 ports in there, but we added another Type-C port on the other side that supports USB. Both ports do support charging of the device. Both ports also do support mini display out through there as well. In order to kind of save battery life as well as maximize space on the motherboard, we only supported um, Thunderbolt 3 on one of the one of the sides. And really it's about making the device as mobile as possible. Any additional ports is always beneficial to the customer, so we made sure we could add the additional USB-C to it as well. And educating the people on how they know if it's the Thunderbolt 3 as opposed to just a regular USB-C. And I think that's the uh, little lightning bolt, right? What we do on our XPS products and the rest of our Dell products is we have a little lightning bolt icon right next to the port that supports it. If you plug a Thunderbolt 3 device into the just a regular USB-C port, the machine will indicate that it doesn't support that higher speeds, so you know you plugged it into the wrong one. So there is going to be some feedback from the device if you do happen to plug it into the wrong so one. So you get a notification on screen? Absolutely. Okay. What's the price point? When When's it coming out? So we actually uh, started selling this on January 2nd of this year, just a couple days ago. Uh, we started at a price point of $999. It's an i5 with 4 gigabytes of RAM and 128 gigabyte SSD, and then it scales up from there. We have both the regular full high definition screen that comes with it as standard, and then also up to a quad high definition plus with just the higher resolution screen for uh, better images as well. And of course, Dell.com to find out more on this? Absolutely, Dell.com. Thanks a lot. All right, thanks, Randall, for your time. All right, you too. Hey guys, thanks a lot for watching that CES video. There's a lot more CES videos coming down the line. Check it out over at geekazine.com or youtube.com forward slash geekazine. Go ahead and subscribe to the channels and definitely geek out.